it's it works then now we go back uh, all the information that hibernate and we hear where it said we how can you digitize your code polygon information this features so you can go with the uh, open street map or open street map with the uh, open layer maybe the button is changed a little bit depending but this is our very second release then it's just the client says no we need to be changed something then we can go here uh, we can change the colors buttons and then you can build yeah you can do when you try to build uh, your 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 application you see you can i can click it and even though you can build it, your tools here i can click it and it's it's the click it's stored by something here so you see that i store the points and store the points and store the points and you see the points and then see the points is located and store the digitized information very roughly at the moment so that's that means you created a polygon just copied it maybe here is a special button to overload the 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 information to the your maps into the your your, your forms just you need to be copied it yeah i have it write down so you need to be close the polygons very fast point and last point that write down this one so then you need to be committed like this so you have a need to pass points need to be last point to same value that's that's all so you hit the you hit the um, the polygons it has to be created that's the way what we expected so it's give it to road name something and then some postal code like that and the geometry polygons and 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 country maybe bangladesh in this country because i put it here from, from bangladesh and you can save it and then you see the exception because this is the additional function add function doesn't work but it has a the real data that's we have it so it didn't need to be fixed so because it's fixed it but with this version maybe our our branch the development branch doesn't doesn't push it yet i need to be march it and then it has to be worked but uh, you see the functionalities works so finally we we get our specifications we build uh, implement our our backend servers at the same time we generate we we, we deploy install our geo server and configure our necessary geo server define our services with the post gis database and then we implement our all features that the client need or our needs and then we deploy this we we put our um, our we put our put our uh, put our our specifications uh, put our uh, specification from uh, put our specification from the clients and then we put our uh, spring boot profile in concept and build our jar files to run the jar files to the, to the local container or any any environments or anything anywhere then you, you and record it with some unit test or you selenium test and run the selenium test in different in different environments that's 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 all that's the professional application and this is the enterprise application we work day by day every day we work this way in the in the release circle repository management uh, re repository management for the source code and uh, repository management for the your jars and repository management for other cases and even though you doc management and test case management you need to be think about really overall idea which features which tools which functionalities which need you need you need to very fast when you start your application which technology even though which ide you need to use you need to think about when you start your developments all set of information well, even though which resource you have it you need to be get it properly the which resource i have it and then so i will put it my source code into the into the master branch that means at least you can work what work we can get it and what we have it here you, you can work with that one and you can run it to this at this source code into the your local machines or any to try it to check it and to learn it from there this is the application for a very beginning to the really professional really professional means who is working 10 years or 15 years into this field 
to the web application developments. That's that's I say. So next screencast I will explain maybe the some other technology like Android development how can do the GUI developments with the same functionalities even though Angular or TypeScript functionalities with the same 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 features. I I try to give you to how the technology changes how the it works and how you do the other technology come to the play to to implement the same features or same functionalities. Just subscribe my channels. And write down your comments. I try to to give it to you. Uh, yeah, what can I do for you? And what's the knowledge share with you? And then you can give it to my feedbacks. How it works or necessary changes. That will be there. And I say I will say goodbye and see you next time. Bye bye bye.